Hey there folks, this is ScreenyXI, welcoming you right back to Let's Play Rayman 2. This is episode 3. In last episode, we checked out the uh, the marsh with Sam the Snake. <laughs> and we did the bio as well, where the pirates were chasing us with cannons and stuff. So, next up, we're going to take the the side route to try and get another 30 lumps. It don't look like there's any, any cages, which is odd. So, let's check it out. I don't know if it's going to be a normal sort of level or not, because this seems... Just from what you can collect from it to be a bit different, but we'll, we'll give it a go. Looks platformy from the little card thing. Aha! Is it one of the mini games? I forgot all about these. Okay, we can we can beat the bitch. We'll do it for the lums. Look how fast she's going. Right. The thing is, we don't want to miss the lums. So even if I have to lose. Or maybe if we lose, we lose all the lumps we got anyway, but we'll... <laughs> we'll win the race next time round if we have to do that. Oh, she waited for us. It's just timed, isn't it? It's one of those things that platformers used to do with mini games where she's actually waiting for us, yeah. Oh. I don't think we're going to do it this time if if we're going for the lumps as well. Ooh, I went the wrong way. No, I gotta try for it. There we go. Right, that gave us time back. Good. <laughs> it gave us tons of time, is what I meant. So we'll be fine now. Ooh, I went a bit awkward then. Okay, wasn't sure if there'd be a lum over there or not. Come on. See, it's easy lums. It's just that you've got it, you're timed at the same time. And I imagine we'll have to get them all again, looking at this, if you lose. I can't remember how you unlock these mini games. Is it to do with how many cages you get or something like that? I don't know. I can't even remember. Come on, let's get up to that timer really quick. Yeah, 30 seconds again. Oh. Good, let's see ages. Yeah, there's lums on this land, so you do have to fly over here. I wasn't sure then. I wasn't too sure. We're not too far from the end, though. Might be another checkpoint yet. I say checkpoint. You know what I mean. A time time boost. Come on. Time's starting to get... Oh, God. Ten, about ten seconds left. Ah, there it is. There it is. There it is. Yeah. Right. I see that lump. It's like the game doesn't let you run either. There's no, like, sprint button. So... You feel like you're going really slow all the time on a timed part. Oh my god. But we've got all the lums. That's amazing. We've got an extra easy 30 lums. 1 minute 55. You made it. I did make it. I didn't beat any records, but god knows. Who cares? <laughs> Thanks, Lee. Ciao. Wow, oh, that's the slowest walk of us. <laughs> Here we go. Just dive on in there. Whew. That wasn't too bad, actually. I was expecting harder. I know we're still early in the game, but I was, I was still expecting harder. Alright. I, I guess we'll save. Just for the sake of it, really. Look at that, though. 150, now 180. And we're just over the one hour mark. It's not going to be a long game. I, I remember that much. I think about 10 hours would, would be fair. There you go. The walk of life done. Is there a walk of death? <laughs> What's the next proper level, then? 35, ooh, Whale Bay. Oh, I remember having trouble with this one. Okay. 35 lumps, 2 cages. Not too bad in terms of collectibles. I missed the whale. <laughs> oh, because there's a water one, though, it's going to be oxygen-y, right? Or lack of. Okay, hi, Clab. <laughs> we got him. Oh, I didn't die. Not kill the Clab. Right then. Oh, I never like water stuff in, in games. I want to get that blue blue lump. Not going without it. Oh, I'll have to go back up. <laughs> it's hard to be really, like, pinpoint with swimming on this game. I see a lump over there. It really is. So, when you're going for oxygen, that's... That's what makes it tricky. Oop, back down, back down. Go on, go on, Rayman, you got this. 
So it might not be a long level. Maybe it won't be. But at the same time, I think it's going to be a bit uh, hard to explore to get all the lums. So maybe that's where the challenge comes in with this one. Come on then, I see it, I see it. Why is it starting to flash when it's only half full? Uh, half empty. That's fine. This end the level I remember. You know what, I'm getting it mixed up with Mario 64. With uh, the water level in Mario 64. Uh, I can't think of the name of it. Which is odd, because I normally normally alright with Mario. What did that do? Is that what it did? Did it open that? No, it didn't. <laughs> I don't remember it being open before. I'm not sure what that's doing, but we'll we'll roll with it. I think it just opened that door, maybe. Alright, checkpoint for it. What do we do now? Can we have a look around a sec? I want to get on that and hang from below. I think we might have to do it from by because they're apparently piranhas. Let me down. There we go. Piranhas in the water below. There we go. Thank you, camera. <laughs> the camera got me then. Right, we got the lums. That's all I care about. If the prana gets us now, I'm not too bothered. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> well, okay then. <laughs> right, are the lums still gone? Yes, they are. Good. Ooh, what's... Is there like a... No. It looked like an indent. Like you could walk into it, a little cave. Right. Let's try and avoid these piranhas again. <laughs> Need to get back on top now, though. So let's go back again. I just saw, like, a checkpoint over there. A green lump. So that's nice. Okay. Turn around. Turn around. There we go. I haven't heard anyone needing help yet, which I love. Come on, Rayman. Rayman, go. Rayman, go. Faster, 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 faster. Ooh. Alright. I guess mini boss time? There, yes. Definitely a boss. A battle. <laughs> Our first proper boss is a battle. <laughs> Alright, I thought we had to wait for the invincibility to go away. Just keep shooting then. Just keep shooting. Just keep shooting. Ah. Is he done? Does he not? I just heard a help. No, he wasn't done. He just went to hide away for a bit. <sighs> Got me. Little bugger. He's slowing the battle down now towards the end. Ah, we gotta hit him loads of times before he falls over. I get ya. I get ya. There we go. If we waited for him to shoot first, that's a, that's how you get him to to do it. And it's our health back. Where's the cage? I can hear him. Yes, I know. I'm trying to help. I just don't know where you are. And that's just sad. That's where we came down. Hmm. Up on top of the barrels? Can we jump on top of the boss? <laughs> Hmm. Right, that got rid of the bars over on the door in the distance. No, we're not going to be able to get on top of... Is it two? I can hear it. I know, I know, it's timed. Those buttons always are, those circle buttons. Must be up on top of the ship or something. This is a much more sort of exploratory... Ooh, there it is. Explorational, um... Level, isn't it? Not exactly completely open or anything, but you know what I mean. Can I turn the camera? No. Even when I press R2, it's not... It wasn't letting me for a sec. Alright, so we need to press the button and lag it. Coming up here was just for the cage, by the looks of it. And maybe a limb or two. Turn around. There we go. Now leg it. I can't do this much faster, I don't think.
Ooh, the music started up. What's coming? Oh, God! <laughs> oh, Christ. Come on, I'm trying to bounce on it. Oh, you can't. You can run on it. Ooh. Camera got me there. Ah, we can bounce on it. Come on, get a lump. You know you want it. <laughs> right, so what I'm going to do now, purely because I feel like we missed the opportunity to get potential lums a bit closer to the wall down here. But actually, I'm doing it and I don't think maybe... Nah, we're good. We got them all for me, I think. Yeah. See, if you miss the cage just going through the game, you'll have so much less max health by the end. And I don't know how people can do it. Like, that's going to be one of those challenge modes that people do, in it? Because this game, there's no difficulty option. You can get the PS2 version of the game. I think it's called Rev Revolutions or something. And you get a, a harder game. But uh, from my view, anyway, I've never, never played it. I've only ever played the PS1 and potentially the N64 one. I, I can't really remember when I was little. I think I had the N64 one, yeah. Okay, I'm on you. I feel like because we're in the water, it's like... You know, not green of time in the water temple <laughs> when you're facing yourself. It feels like that sort of one on one sort of vibe. Not quite facing ourselves. This ain't no dark ray, man. I heard another cage. Right. I think it's actually going to be easier for this fight because he's running around so much. Not to hold R2 and try and lock on. There we go. I think that was easier. And there we go. A bit of health back as well. And a bit more. Right. I don't think we can get through that door yet. I know, I know, I can hear you. Wait, can we? No, the metal is like a new ability, isn't it? Yes, we can't do it yet. So, we're going to have to take the high road. Before I head in, I want to have a quick look around in case I can do something with that, that purple lum. It doesn't seem like it. Alright, let's head in. So what that tells me is that if we don't get the power now, we'll have to come back later and get it. There are those sorts of backtracky elements to this game, like with Rayman 1. Sometimes. Ooh. We need to hit... I think we need to hit the four switches, I think that's the point. Yeah, there we go. One light does lit up in the bottom right of the screen. Two. <gasps> <laughs> I'm trying to look out for lums and stuff as well, obviously. The usual. How many lums have we got? We've got loads. We're doing fine. Oh, we can't go up now. It's not good. We better go back for a sec. And there's the fourth, fourth switch by there. But what I'm going to do before that... Oh, an oxygen lum. A blue lum. Nice. That's what I needed. Oh, that was, that was pretty bloody close. Here we go. The planners are coming to take my air bubbles. I mean, little shits. Planners are always little shits. Come on. Before I do anything else, once again, I'm going to go back and get our oxygen back. But he does give air bubbles, like he said, so that's pretty amazing. So let's just follow the whale. <laughs> yeah, get our oxygen from him as we travel. But the piranhas can get him as well. That's the that's the evil thing. No. I don't know if me shooting actually did that. Stop the piranha. Yeah, it does. It makes him go away a bit. Oi! What the hell? I can see why I used to find this bit awkward now. I don't want to drown. I really don't. Ooh, ooh, we got it. It don't fully recover your oxygen, but gives you some out. <sighs> I was lucky to get both of them then. I didn't think I would. Back down, back down, back down. Come on, right there. Got it. Oh, look at Rayman's face. He looks so upset. Right. Oh, I was going to say we're back in the non-flashy zone then. 
No! Prana, you little shit! Okay, good. Yes, we needed that. We can't miss any of them now, I don't think. Oh, Prana! As long as we get this lump. Nah, I didn't think that was going to happen. It was going to work out. Do we have to get the yellow lumps again? No, it doesn't seem like we do. So, come on then, whale. Let's try this bit again. You little turd. From the very get-go, you ate our oxygen. <laughs> oh, it's not working. Not working out. Things are not coming up Millhouse. <laughs> Anna's sod off. You are getting on my nerves. The fact is that they can hurt you as well, so that's not good either. It's going so much easier without need to get the yellow lumps though. I appreciate that. I'm not sure if when we come back for the cage later on, the one that was behind that door that we couldn't open yet. I'm not sure if we'll have to finish the level or if you can quit the level once we have the cage. I think you might have to finish it, so I might have to do it again. I will make you sit through it again, don't worry. I'll just show you um, when we get the, the cage, probably. At the fir first, earliest point. Oh, I twat. We've got plenty of oxygen, we're fine. Um, but yeah, first possible time once we've learnt the ability, I'll come back and get that out of the way so I don't forget. Get it, get it, get it. Where are the yellow lums? We haven't seen them for ages. And I, I know, I know, we already collected some. But it still feels like a while since. Shoot, shoot, shoot. There we go. Since since we saw one. Even still. This one. I'd rather go for the lum than the oxygen, but they. With a choice of the two. I, I don't think it was a choice. I think we could have got both, but still. This all the lums? Nice. Just need to survive it now. And we did! Yes! Oh, there's more. I thought that would have been the next level, what he was showing us. But we've got plenty of oxygen going into this part, so that's, that's all good. Whatever, I can miss one or two blue lumps on the way up. Oh, what was the point? Just uh, just in case, I guess. Oh, I see red lumps down there. Let's get them. I don't know if we really need it. I think we had like half health or something. But it'll help for the next level, you know. It'll get us through this level, hopefully. Uh, yeah, you know. Okay, now our oxygen. We might need the blue lumps now. It's funny how they put the red lumps there, though. Like, how do you know to turn around and get some red lumps when all the yellow lumps are done already? the tranquility of this place. Uh, but I'm Rayman. Rayman? The name means nothing to me. What do you want? I have to gather together the four masks to bring Polycus back. This is our last chance to chase the pirates away. How am I to know that you are not simply a thief? Only your strength and bravery can convince me. Prepare to fight. Okay, our first proper boss. Like, there was a barrel, which I consider a mini-boss. 
I'm trying to think, if if you lose this, can you just start from the boss again, as in on the world map and stuff? Because of the lock-on, though, it really makes this purple lump stuff so much easier. Like, he's chucking shit, and that can be, you know, bad, but... Ugh, that didn't work out very well. I shot, but it didn't actually hit. <laughs> you know. So I was talking about auto lock on being a godsend, and it didn't end up being that way at all. Oh god, I thought that would have hit me. Maybe I need to do it a bit quicker. Is that why I didn't get him that time? I don't know. I think I just noticed what I meant to be doing. I think there's a like a giant icicle above him. Is that what it is? Come on, up you get, every man, up you get. It's taken me a moment to figure this bit out, even though I've already done it. Bollocks, 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 bollocks. That's talking, nice. <laughs> I can't multitask, I'm a man. You know how it is. <laughs> oh, sexist stereotypes that don't affect men. What do you know? I tried, but I was looking the wrong way. Oh, Christ, this is going to be a long boss, isn't it? I think it's the first of the four mask bosses. I do like the story of the masks in this one. It reminds me of Crash Bandicoot, actually. Getting the masks and all that sort of stuff. Bollocks, it actually hit. Mm -hmm. Attempt number 551. Right, so straight away after I jump off this time, I am going to aim. I'm just going to shoot. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to shoot. Yes! I thought that would be it. Wow! Lost his head. Did it only take one hit? Wow! It, it, it only took one hit. Yeah, it's right, but that was such an easy boss compared to... Like... I appreciate, highly appreciate, the easier difficulty of this game compared to the first one. Because the first one, if I didn't have those cheats, we were never getting through that game. I was never getting through that game. Like, I wouldn't even... I would give up. And I used to when I was little. I didn't used to use the cheats when I was little. And I used to just give up after the first couple of worlds in Rayman 1. There we go. We made it. So, uh, yeah, it's, it's good that Rayman 2 became easier. Hey, we found the first mask. Three more to find. <laughs> oh, I think that was the watery one. It looked sort of waterish. Welcome. I am Holocus, the spirit of the world. I see that you have found the first of my four masks. For now, I am far away can only speak in dreams. But if you bring me the last three masks, I will awaken and help you fight the pirates. destiny. 
It's lucky the world's test in the end in our arms, isn't it? <laughs> Screwed. <laughs> but he spun like a new world, like a new teleporter. That's interesting. He is the 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 being of the dreams. Like the first game had a lot of dreamy stuff as well, didn't it? So yeah, that is our episode all done up. We are done. So let us save on over. I think we'll save over the empty. I think I need to start doing three at a time. I got an idea for that. Anyways, uh, accept. Yes. So there we go. We missed one cage because we had to. I don't like seeing that, but we'll have to come back. So, this has been Greeny XI. Hope you've enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you again in a bit when I assume we're going to see if we can get through the door. Remember I said we needed 150 lums? Well, we should be fine. <laughs> Thanks again for watching, folks. See you again in a bit.